Hello there, this is Space Runner 5. Welcome back to episode 7 of our Cherokee Let's Play series where we are becoming a monster. We are huge, massive at this point because we did go ahead and in inherit all of our tribal lands. We are going through the reforms very slowly. Emphasis on that. Let's go ahead and occupy you guys. You want to go ahead and become a vassal. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the fold. We're going to go ahead and start working on you. We're going to go ahead and send you all of your special modifiers to get your opinion up. You're going to give us... Doesn't share a trade note. That's interesting. No one's going to stop us. All right, we'll give you military access for additional 10 opinion. All right, so we're just waiting on that one siege. You guys are doing your thing over here. That's fine. Our army reformer passed on. That's uh, not great. What do we got here? Land force limit modifier? Nah, morale of armies. Do we make enough money? Oh, yeah, we definitely do make enough money. Go ahead and have level 2 advisors now. We're way behind in tech. That's okay. We're just we're winning with bodies, and that's how we're winning our wars. You are done. Come on down here. Uh, please stay away from my uh, my Merc Siege stack. Let's go ahead and actually build some boats, too, to blockades, because... Oh, someone's got the first boat. Darn, I was just going to be like, we can go ahead and have their first boat. Right, we'll go ahead and start building two boats for ourselves. Stay away from my natives, or from my, uh, my Mercs. Those are not my natives, but... <laughs> Potato, potato, you know? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wait, we know about, wait. War Horde and we can see all this now? Like, what? I'm a little confused on this one, but... Sure, we're in the Horde cult, or the Horde uh, tech group, so that's why we can see it now. That means they can all start getting aggressive expansion for us expanding over here, which is kind of funny. It's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and move off our main stack. Say, just conserve some of our manpower. I'd prefer to keep it. You, my friend, are getting sort of peace. You are getting full annex. Goodbye. It costs us zero double points. So, we want your money too, though. These are more buildings for me. So, when the Europeans come, we might be able to throw enough manpower and bodies at it, so it's no longer an issue. I'm going to raise that, because you're going to give me more than what it costs to core it. And now we'll march south. This is also give us the horde unity that we need desperately. Mm, too bad. You are going to get full Annex 2. It's going to cost us a couple Diplo points. We're still going to make more than what we're going to spend, so that works for me. Get your butt down there, and you guys go and rest there. That should be fine. We just want to go ahead and build... Oh, you guys have six boats. I stand correct. Oh, they're all clogs. We can build the first heavy, though. And really rule the waves. Sure, there we go. First heavy. Uh, five devastation. That sucks. You guys are coming in on our mercs. Unfortunately, we have the other mercs on their way. Be there tomorrow. Okay. Victory! Yeah, that was close. Oh, we can go ahead and do the Age of Discovery since we've reached 100 development. Oh, do we have our own? Feudal Society. Resident Two Continents. Humiliated Rival. Oh, we get our own uh, speci special things. That's cool. I like that. Do not indeed have a large city. Not yet. Uh, nope, we're going to stay in this war until this, this siege is over. Can't give you trade power. Already have military access. Go ahead and give that guarantee over here. There you go. <clears throat> Gain innovativeness. Uh, sure. I'm not sure we can do much with it, though. It's going to be constantly just being burnt. Yeah, negative 0.3 because we're behind in all three techs. Yes, we are. Hmm. Does that mean I can actually embrace the uh, Renaissance, though? Am I dead for it? Because we're no longer... I'm uh... going to do a test for that real quick. Where's a cheap province we can dev? Devastation's awfully high. Can I... Can I do a click? Oh. We can indeed dev for the institution. That's going to be pretty cool. Alrighty, so that means we can go ahead and dev for the institutions, which means we can become overpowered now. We need to go ahead and find our cheapest province to go ahead and develop. It's all grasslands, pretty good. Actually, probably want to move our capital here so we can purposely take those engagements. So, development. Cost. 46, right here. Is our capital? It is our capital. Capital's cheapest, go ahead and develop. Uh, can we move our capital, actually? Well, I want it on this grasslands instead. 
It's only, oh, it's only three development too. Uh, we can pay the extra penalty, it's okay. We're gonna get super overpowered. All right, we're gonna go ahead and encourage development in our capital. You, my friend, are gonna get dev for Diplo. Diplo and admin, it kinda looks like. We're going to spawn a couple institutions here, hopefully. Actually, we're gonna do one here, embrace it, and then we'll go ahead and spawn the next one. There you go, production. Uh, we honestly need more manpower in order to continue. Oh, war taxes are free right now. I was like, war taxes, no! <laughs> I always forget to unclick them, and I thought I unclicked them again. All right, you guys, go ahead and protect trade in the Chesapeake Bay. We're going to easily become the uh, leader of the trade power, or the largest trade power in the area. We're going to go ahead and full annex both of you. Be gone. Bye. Don't really... Oh, can't raise either of those, can't we? No. All right, fair enough. I was hoping to raise them. Go ahead and start Corrin. Who's next? You guys don't have very many troops. How many, uh, what military tech are you on? Six? Oh, that's kind of scary, though. We'll just throw enough bodies at it to solve that issue. There we go. You guys are almost ready to go ahead and get vassalized. There we go. Now you're currently at war. You see, that will prevent us. Do we have available relationship slots as well? We do. All right, who wants to be a vassal? Who in their right mind wants to be a vassal underneath us? Uh, we have royal marriages. Not interested. Three favors. No, it's this one. You would take it. Oh, you've reformed. You gonna be a vassal? No, no you don't. You're hostile towards us. We're domineering to you, though. We'll come up here later and, and uh, destroy you. That will seem fine to me. Cherokee. I mean, you're stuck. You're kind of stuck in here. You could be a tributary. Or do you want to be a vassal? Not too inclined to be a vassal, huh? You. You could be persuaded. You got 7k troops. So you guys also have 7k troops. They're a military tech ahead of you, or we can just eat them. I vote for eating, probably. Alrighty, so who, where do we want to go ahead and start expanding? You want to be a vassal? No. Alrighty, we might as well just pick whoever then. You. Come along. You will be a vassal and you will enjoy it. Oh yeah, I forgot about you, I'll be honest. Sorry. I wish I could raise the tribal development, but that would be stupidly overpowered. There we go, go ahead and do that. That's quite a bit of development there. Raise that. And it'll make it me make it possible for us to go ahead and do that. We're going to core everything. I don't need to concentrate development on land that we're actually going to keep as our own, which is pretty much everything here we're going to have as our own development. So. There we go. Our capital is doing fine. It probably needs a building, though. Let's be realistic. Do you need a building? Probably. Taxes will probably give us quite a bit of money. Yeah. 0.56 ducats. We're going to develop all this area. Nice and high. <clears throat> You're building the heavy. That's fine. And what do we need to actually go ahead and embrace this institution? Oh, we're not at 10% of our uh, our land yet. Interesting. Honestly, would have guessed that would have been enough development. Is the autonomy high here? No, there is no autonomy. As long as the true faith, sure. Not going to mind that. We do still have to totemist ideas. So what do we got? Yearly armor just decay minus 2%. We can actually we get get enough of that. We can actually make so we actually gain armor tradition regardless. Keep it capped. Perpolations plus 40% is huge. Uh, that's phenomenal. There would be like no AE ever. Our heavy is almost done, which is nice. Making three ducats. Oh. Oh, we can't do this yet. I was like, that's great. Give us more money. We'll throw it into the economy. Oh, did our ally just get annexed? The guy that we're going to vassalize? Yeah, he did. That sucks. You. You like vassalization? Yeah, you just ate them. Sure, come on in. We'll get you going. You are not allied to these guys. Perfect. You shall declare war. I mean, I don't really need you, but... Where are you? Not friends with us, that's for sure. You? One per... Oh, our ally will not join. Perfect. Then we shall go here. Call you on a sculptor jet. Mm hmm... He's going to also eat these guys. 
They have 8k though. Alright, so we stomp here and stomp there. Or we just stomp there, actually. Yeah, that should be fine. Be fine. Not to worry. Get your butts in there. We go over here with these mercs. And should be a wallop. There you go. Instant stack wipes. Great. Split. There we go. Is that everyone? Oh, we got one. One guy missing. That should be fine. Let's go ahead and prove relations with these guys. They'll end up becoming a vassal. And then who's the other, other ones that we're working on? Ah, just you right now. All right, so we ha do have an additional relationship. You guys have 18,000 troops. I would not mind them. Uh, you say no. You say no, too. You guys? You guys are indeed going to be it. We're going to go ahead and get a real marriage with you. And then we'll start improving relations when we get a chance. There we go. Already doing a lot of our occupations. More truces. Wonderful. Only need the one diplomat. That's fine. Oh, you. You're the one that we have the peace deal on. Uh, we'll go ahead and help our ally for a second. Can we? There you go. Yeah. Improve your pin of us. We are doing a great service to you. Alright. We'll go ahead and give you a guarantee. There we go. Additional 10 opinion. Thank you. We appreciate you. Goodbye. You vassals are already starting their sieges. Great. Get some more taxes. Definitely not what we really want to be building off of, but we're natives and hell, we can even tax right now. That's kind of strange for us. <laughs> In all honesty, let's go and bring that. Oh, we are getting blockades over here. You guys are getting siege down. That's fine. Not concerned. That siege is over. We'll go over here with that level two siege or two siege pip guy. You guys go ahead and get out there. You guys just might migrate. Is that what just happened? Looks like it. New Tribal Feud CB. Let's see, how much land can I actually take in each each fight? Dink, dink, dink. All of that will be mine. I guess we can probably do everything all in one piece deal. Kind of what it looks like. Go and occupy that real quick. You guys are working on occupying my land. I don't think so. Stay away from my land. It's mine. It's all mine. Let's go and see how expensive this institution is, because it's probably spread by now, right? Nope, not yet. Still working on it. So you are done. Just waiting on this last siege. You are almost ready. Let's go ahead and give us your trade power. So we should trade a hold the same trade node now. Yep. Nah, it's just the influenza. Although the inf the modern influenza is what killed so many natives. That's kind of. That's scary. That's that, like, that's the plague coming. That's smallpox coming and killing like 90% of the population over here. That's what happened. I uh, imagine that's not going to go well. Can't take this one province. Okay. We will separate PCU for both provinces. I don't care about the diplo points. It is a small price to pay. Hmm. You're not willing. So don't give me this one. Because then you're stuck. We'll just eat you later. Go ahead and your alliances. You don't need those anymore. Uh, they're going to be dead, so it doesn't matter about them. Here we go. Go and raise this and core it. It's got a lot of devastation. That's okay. Manpower recovery speed. We'll take that. You. I actually want these guys vassalized first. Uh, I don't think they'll be calling in the war, though. Actually, it doesn't matter. Go ahead and do that. That will do. Give me... All 15 ducats of nothing. Okay. You're going to be fully annexed. Could make you... Uh, no, you're fine. Got a little bit of de development there. You guys did do some clicks. Great. For all that. And what do we have for accepted cultures? Do we need to go ahead and accept another one? We only have two. Hmm. What is our capital culture? I don't have 90... Oh, no, that's not the capital. I was like, how do we have 90 autonomy? Hmm. I think I'll take those diplo points. Anything else that needs to be cored? Uh, you do. Good. Go and core both those. You guys are going to be 
adjacent to us now, which is perfect. Go ahead and give you a military access, give you additional 10 opinion, that works for me. And you, my friend, go ahead and pick up that alliance. There you go, cores are starting to roll in, we do have some rebels. Horde unity is going up, perfect, that's what we want to see. What do you want, Diplotech? Uh, no, we're going to do the uh, institution. It's slowly building, slowly churning. Let's go ahead and change you over to Institution Spread. You have a pretty big negative on that, right? Let's see. Institution Spread. Oh, now we got a bonus. Reform Step Nomads, minus 15%. Oh, and Devastation. Devastation doesn't help. I see. Look, we got Devastation all over our land. which It's probably about time we start building some forts. Influence is a thing. It will indeed go away. That is the hope and the dream. You, my friend. Have some friends, okay. What about you? You don't really look like you have very many. Oh, you got 41,000 troops. Never mind. Oh, you have former Erie. They used to be our friends. Then we killed everyone. Could make you a tributary. How about you? Um, you started to reform. Aggressive expansion is too big of a thing. How about you? You actually are kind of someone I wish to uh, kill. Mm, you're too big. Okay. That is our former ally. That seems fine. Oh, we don't have a CB on you? We're touching. Our borders are next to each other. It's time to expand, is what I'm saying. Oh, no, we're not. That is a mountain province. We do not share a border. Hmm. Lucky you. You, my friend, once you're a thing, we'll go ahead and send you a gift. I think 25 decks would probably be enough, right? Yep. Good. Enjoy the money. Enjoy being a vassal, too. Welcome to the fold. Oh, you're split. Oh, I see. How'd you guys get over here? Oh, you guys must have uh, reformed. Yeah, everyone's starting to reform now. It's fine. No complaints there. You guys are a little big. You guys are up there. I think we go north, right? Is this what we have to do now? That or it's time to build up a bigger army. Yeah, it's time to build a bigger army. Go up to seven of each. You guys will be a little short. All right, and you guys go ahead and start moving north. Not sure you guys go ahead and get stated. We have plenty of governing capacity. How are we doing over here for the no trail, no tears? We got 28 out of 62 already. Very nice. Yeah, we're doing fine. I don't see any colonizers over here. There's our truce with you. Not a lot of development. Oh, that's our capital. That's not you. You it? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so one person inside that alliance chain. Is big and beefy. You guys do this guy first. <clears throat> this army moves there. This army is here as well. Because we'll go ahead and occupy all this. And the Merc stacks will go after that. That'll be fine. Oh, there you go. Extra manpower. We'll take it. It's the only thing. Oh, military leader did just leave us. Hmm. It was you. Take a new one. Well, he's got... Doesn't have any fire. Oh, that's a mountain province. That's not definitely not where we want to fight. <clears throat> we'll go ahead and just steam on in, though. Bruce with you. You're a vassal, my friend. Also a vassal. Come on back. You. Go ahead and just send you a gift. Mm. Don't have enough money to actually send them. All right, give us trade power, then. That would be beneficial. I think it's time we go ahead and declare war. Not on you, though. Yeah, you have too big of a friend. You, though. Goodbye, we'll slowly destroy these alliance chains left and right. Funnel in, you're going to need to reinforce, because we're going to have a negative 25 penalty on top of a negative 2, which is going to be bad. Never mind, it wasn't nearly as bad as I thought it was going to be. Split. You have a siege pit leader, go over there, and... Doesn't really matter, these are going to be pretty even stacks except for one. Oh good, you're going to go occupy that for us. Thank you for the free stab. We appreciate that. 
Druce at Iroquois. Uh, too bad you guys are going to be a thing for us for quite some time. Go, both occupations are done. And now we go ahead and start rooting north. Let's go ahead and go over here. You were going to be a vassal. And then you decided not. Oh, can we have the strong? No, we cannot have the strong duchies. So it's like, oh, that'd be awesome. Strong duchies. No, 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 not a thing. You guys, uh, equilibrium is ugh, super low. Build the agenda, but you guys need your uh, much higher equilibrium. Here we go. Less loot is fine. 44. I guess we'll do this one too. Lose 5% crown lands. That's fine too. I need you guys to be loyal so we can get more manpower recovery and stuff like that. You guys have two provinces, I see. <clears throat> we will take both then. That will be it. Take this and we'll go north. You guys are almost ready to be vassals. Go ahead and we are... Oh, claim that guarantee and then you'll be vassals next month. How exciting is that going to be for you guys? We're just going to have little hordes running around. <laughs> I don't think we get anything for tributaries other than the fact that they're tributaries, right? Yeah. You're dependent on us. Yeah, but I wish to peacefully like integrate you into the system. Right, you guys fall off just so you don't have to suffer additional attrition. Oh, that siege is over. Great. Um, Go north, I guess. These merc stacks have been imperative and they've been around for so long. Go ahead and get a couple extra boats, because I don't think anyone really has any boats right now. Yo, we'll be able to defend our coast, hopefully, if we have enough heavies, eventually. <clears throat> Destroy them before they can even land. That'd be awesome. Probably not super likely, but, you know, if we could, that'd be awesome. Alright, one of our merc stacks is low on manpower. I care not. It is not my manpower that, that is being burnt. Let's go and walk off. Oh, you've trapped them on Long Island. No, that's not Long Island. Long Island's over here. Manhattan. This is Nova Scotia. No, this is Nova Scotia. I don't know Canada. I just know U.S. <laughs> 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 All right. We want to go ahead and full annex everyone. It's way too expensive. Okay. You get several piece. Thank you for your land. Oh, you say no for now. Give me this province, and give me that one. And that one. Oh, perfect. You'll become an OPM. Wonderful. There we go. And send that. And this province... Oh, this is actually quite a bit of development. Thank you for developing all this land for me to raise. This is another province that we took. This one. Alright, can't raise that one. That's okay. Get cord. Institution, it's still trying to spread. It's trying. There you go. You have the least amount of devastation, right? Yeah. Oh, no, you guys have no devastation. Why are you spreading faster here? Nearby friendly province with it. Same with this one, though. The modifier is 58 versus 36. Why are you higher? There's it must be a hidden mechanic there. I'm doesn't make sense. <laughs> <laughs> this makes no sense. Alrighty. Local development, local goods produced. Uh, no, let's piss them off. I don't care if they're happy or not. Mercs, go say hi there. I think that's the only thing we're waiting on for this. <clears throat> we don't have any rivals that we can possibly have right now, which kind of sucks. Negative zero. Well, we're just going to throw bodies into here, and it shouldn't be an issue. There we go. Full stack light. We uh, will say farewell to you, or no, we can just full annex everyone at the same time. Don't have to pay any Diplo points for it. Give me your little itsy bitsy amount of money. Five ducats is nothing. Each ducat is worth quite a bit, actually, apparently. Say goodbye. I don't think we care about aggressive expansion very much. Uh, you just get cord. It's a very good trade good there. Go ahead and do that. And here. Pretty much paid for that core with admin points, so we're just funneling it. Diplo and military points, which are going to let us go ahead and embrace those institutions just a little bit quicker. A little bit easier. <clears throat> yeah, we're not going to catch up in tech right now. Oh, people are actually joining a coalition against us. I was not imagining that. Who just joined? 
I didn't think aggressive expansion would be a thing over here. You. 50k. Ah, that is indeed a big alliance block, I'll be honest. <clears throat> that would be a scary battle. When we're kind of stuck up here, because I don't have any cogs yet. Hmm. Guess it's time to build some cogs. Cog uh, one, two, three, four. Will be enough to go ahead and move those entire merc stacks because otherwise you can't move them. More people are joining the coalition. That's scary. Let's see who's in the coalition. Who can we target right away? You have friends. Twenty-five thousand. Okay, that looks like it's probably a pretty good target. You? How about you? Twenty-five k as well. That should be fine. No CB, though. That's a lot. Oh, that's super nice, actually. Where are you? How are you in the coalition? You're so far away. You are joining. You have just a coalition, actually. That should be fine. Apparently, I needed to be concerned about that. No, oh, you're the smallest coalition. Sure. We shall declare war on this coalition, just so we can go ahead and fight them. I do need military access, though. You want to give it to me? No, you're hostile. I see, that would do it. Mm -hmm. Improved relations to you guys. There's our cores rolling in. Uh, you're hostile, you're hostile. Alright, fine, we'll go on improved relations with you. We can walk through here at the north, at the very least. We have this army over here to be able to combat all of these guys. And I guess we're probably going to take land in this coalition war as long as we're, like, fighting everyone here. We'll go ahead and maintain with these guys. We'll send them a gift and they'll be happy. Buy a little 5k. Guys are military tech ahead, but it doesn't matter when you're tiny. Oh, no, there's actually an army coming. Stay together. Good, now we have military access. Wonderful. Merc stack, go there. You guys go south. That's not their own that that's not their only province. That should be fine. Uh vassals are gonna get sieged, that's okay. You are sitting on my capital. I don't appreciate that, my friend. You have enough money, send you a gift. No one else is joining the coalition right now, so I feel kind of comfortable. Uh no, we don't we can't afford to lose horde unity right now. It's too good for us. Welcome to the world of being a vassal. Go ahead and meander on over to our capital, make sure it's relieved. Taking out a navy, very nice. Appreciate that. We like coastal forts now because our navies are plenty strong enough to go ahead and deal with them. Guys have left our capital. Great. Uh, that's mountains. It's not right there. Not a core yet. That's also okay. I'll just occupy over here. There we go. <laughs> Can't separate peace people because this is a coalition. That's fine. I uh, will lose prestige. Prestige is not a big deal. How are we doing over here? Acquire subjects. Uh, yeah, we will do that eventually. Uh, we can't quite get down the line anyway, so it doesn't really make that big of a difference. Uh, discipline. That's actually worth it now. Since we have reformed. Go ahead and statify Georgia. Georgia. Very nice. Uh, let's go over here. I don't really want you occupying my land. There we go. This siege is almost over. Who can we actually sever peace, though? Um, Just you. You're the only one we can sever peace. What does that mean? Probably full annexation. Let's be realistic. This is hills, but it is defensive terrain for us at the very least. They will take a negative one, and we'll just kind of go like that. Waiting for the siege. That siege is over. Great. We'll go there, then. Uh, go north. Boats are getting sunk left and right. Full stack wipes. That's what we like to see. You guys come back in. We'll defend here. Another full stack wipe, just because of our massive morale bonuses. Continue to just stack wipe. Left and right. Wonderful. 
right, you guys split. Go and siege both these guys. We'll also send a little little stack over here. Oh, you guys went north. Let's go say hi. We're, we're too big now. Don't go away. We have cab. You guys don't know what horses are yet. Never seen them before, and then suddenly we just roll up with thousands of them. As long as we keep cycle truce timing too, we should be fine. Wish we had more uh more power projection, but we have no possible rivals, so that's a thing. We'll go on down south over here. Continue to siege. Siege seem to be going progressing fine. Go occupy. Actually, they got enough manpower. That, uh, no, just sit there. Help them. That's a okay with me. You guys are our cogs. And are heavy. Yeah, you guys just get over there. Looks like we're probably going to need build up more of an army. That should be fine, though. Just go ahead and combat these coalitions. Uh, oh, we've died. A 454 air. Uh, we lost our horde unity, though. That kind of sucks. Who do we have? Who's disloyal? Why are you disloyal? I guess we're real marriage. No longer disloyal. You vassal? You are a vassal. Great. Come on back. <clears throat> and you decided to fight us because we don't have a leader anymore. On top of the hills, uh, please give me a leader. We're all armies plus 5%. That's going to be very useful. Give me a leader, please. No, you went somewhere else. Need horse. This army's going to get stack wiped. It suffered long and hard just because they keep throwing more bodies in. Oh, good. We got there in time. Uh, go home. Just go home. You guys died. Go, guys, go. Just because you ha you took so many battles. You, my friend, are gone. Coalition. Yeah, that's some people. It's fine. Give me your 15 ducats because I can have it. Goodbye. One less member of that coalition. Go ahead and core that. There we go. You have two siege pips. Uh, no, we're all going to go there. Okay, that's fine. You guys go there. You guys go home to reinforce. That siege is over as well. Go ahead and pick up your brothers and go back home. So you're not going to suffer more attrition. I mean, if you guys are going to attack me, I might as well take more land, you know? Probably start annexing people, though. You and you, go away. You go away. I want to take all of this, though. That's too much. Get you so I can actually almost walk to and, f to and fro my land. Do that, and I guess we'll take that, too. 98%, how far are we? 30 reasons. We don't care about coalitions, just saying. Especially such weak and feeble ones. Builder attack is going to be huge for us, though. How close are we to that institution? We are... 9.1%. It keeps getting worse, actually. <laughs> Why is the autonomy so high over here? What's the unrest? Three? Oh, okay, I guess we're going to hold off on that. Are there any leaders that's worth us keeping around for here inside of our religion? Group relations, national taxes, construction costs gets produced. We're going to have this guy for more morale of armies just become stupidly good in terms of military. I think that's what we want to do. Hmm. Oh, he's got three siege. Sure. That's not stupidly broken on a horde. Yeah, negative three weight. Three reasons away. This war is pretty much over. <clears throat> Do you think we gotta go ahead and go north, though? You guys are doing fine. Can't even drill right now with our armies, hilariously enough. You have friends? You do indeed have friends. Well, we'll go ahead and expand that towards you eventually. Take those guys out. Sure, you guys can have military access. Don't mind me. <clears throat> oh, and we're at 99% now. Say goodbye, you guys. Coalition, eh, it still grows, but we're going to go ahead and start churning up some wars. 
<laughs> Little overextended. Go ahead and raise that one real quick. Nothing to raise here. It's not actually worth anything. You become Corable. Manhattan was a big problem. Let's go ahead and raise that. There we go. Wonderful. Alrighty, but that is just all the time I have for today. Let's go ahead and make that an accepted culture. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, please like and subscribe. Have a wonderful day.